one place by insulting another. And at the end of the day, like I know for a fact, you get triggered as hell when somebody mentions your your the ethnicity of your husband. So you telling me you're not gonna get mad at somebody be like, well, whatever town your husband's from is dirty. I don't get. I, I'm not gonna get mad if they talk about my town, his town. They don't talk about his town. They talk about my husband specifically. So that's different. They bring up my husband specifically. Oh. Yeah, because when I got mad at you, I see something about you. I don't know. Okay, so that's what I'm saying. But it's okay because. I mean, we were ha we probably was having a back and forth, but that's what they do. So you even admit you say something about my husband specifically, and that's what other people do. So that'll get me mad. But if you say, "Yeah, Africa ain't this, Africa ain't that," I'll have a conversation with with you just like I did with Manny. No, that's wrong for you to say Africa. Africans have tubs, they have stoves, they have this and that. I'm not gonna curse him out for that. He just don't know. But when you come for me or my husband or kids specifically, that's different. Right, so you just said it's wrong. You just said bringing up a place and mentioning the stuff that's wrong with it is, or not wrong with it, but saying um, derogatory stuff is wrong. And then you just did it. Hold on, I did it. Cause she, I, I'm not gonna talk to you just to get it. Cause you're purposely not wanting to hear. You want to come back and not listen. No, what we're trying to say, there's no reason to do thing. it. She, what she's do, what she did, it is a reason to do it. If she's um, offended me, she came for me. So I come for her. Don't act like when we, we when we're in these wars against each other, just like um Barb just a minute she came from my husband. We're gonna go to hell and back. But don't tell me that I can't go to a hell with a motherfucker who's trying to take me there. Nobody's not gonna do that to me. You're not going to tone police me about a about a bitch that keep bothering me. Yeah, okay, so all right, let me make an example. That's like what Pussy said what she said about the gay community. So it's like a whole gay community came to her, right? Oh, oh, probably still coming. I don't know. I've not been she wished, But she wished unaliving on people. Mm -hmm. She wished unaliving on the entire community. I said I'm not going to Haiti and starve. How can those two be comparable? Because that's because it's not true of Haiti. But, yeah. It's not true of the country. It's very ignorant, actually. Very extremely ignorant. Who, who, cares? who cares? I'm not trying to be... Uh, I'm not trying to have a, a lot of in intellect or be politically correct or arguing with people. Hmm. People who care are the other the other Haitians that did nothing to you and were offended by that statement. Okay, yeah. well they're they're offended because I talked about Haiti. I didn't talk about them personally. Oh well. So next. Well, you don't care about that. So let me move on back to where I was because I'm nosy. So back to this dying thing, right? <laughs> so definitely. I, 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 I just have to ask because I like you know I was one. I said a lot okay. about um. Remember I said a lot, even when we was arguing. I was like, yeah, you did, you did, you did. You want so I'm gonna probably say these things now to get my point across. So I was saying how you want to be a diamond ass. You want to sit in diamond's lap. You know, right. all this, right, right. I, for the life of me, I heard what you said the first time, but it still does not like help me understand. You're you're seeing actual panels with people don't like diamond. This was a person he was fond of. Just because she allowed somebody to, uh, in your words, dog power you, whatever, does it bring that much hatred on for you from a person? Hey, that I once like this person let people speak to me this way, but she never spoke to me. She never defends me. Is it because you want some type of loyalty from Diamond? And I always say this from the beginning. And I still feel like you expected some type of loyalty from Diamond, and you didn't get that loyalty. Is that why you feel the way you feel now? I don't expect loyalty from somebody that I don't even really know. We only know each other from TikTok. I never expected loyalty from her, but I do expect people to tell the truth. Just like what you were saying, all of you, what you were saying, you've even said it on her panel, but she act like she had never heard it. Diamond literally sat there and say, oh, nobody ever said nothing like that on my panel. Seriously. So I expect people to stand on the truth. That's what I expect them to stand on. Not loyalty. But you, but, but, but you remember you said Diamond never said nothing. She just making faces. So she's never said nothing. So. What, what did you want? You can to read. I was, I was reading her. I was reading her. I was oh, reading her. facial expressions was the truth. Mm -hmm. uh, her facial expressions. Her facial expressions. Expressions was fuck you. That's what her facial expressions was. Oh. You you, you just lost me about twenty seconds. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know facial expressions could make you. What um, when you when you when you read somebody? Oh my goodness! I, you you have no. To I understand it. facial expression, but what yeah. I, I understand facial expression. Let no just, okay. about that. But what, what, what I see is I don't. I don't. No facial expression has ever made me run to the enemy. Like you know, you he was right about that. Without oh no, I ain't ran to no enemy because me and Kiana ain't never been no enemy. Me and Kiana have always been friends. Me and uh me and um 
Uh, uh, shoot, I, I can't even get her name. I'm running to them because I, 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 I like Kiana. I have Kiana on my yeah, but, so I've always I don't, been I don't speak like negatively on Diamond to Kiana. What Diamond and Kiana got going is what Diamond and Kiana's business, and, and I would hope Kiana does not speak negatively about um, Diamond on my panel. If they're there and they, they chose to exchange words, that's on them because they're grown. I would never yeah, even, yeah. stop them from exchange words, but. Like I saw and I was just baffled, like God damn for real. You know, like I was just baffled by that. Question for you. What do you think about um what she told me? I was in the in the comments and I was saying something about when she uh who was it? When Poetic went over to um Aries' live to clear something up. And I was shocked and appalled that Diamond said, Oh, I'm a father. Who's she going over there? Ain't nobody asked her ass to go, but for me, that's not how you do your employees, and that's wrong. And nobody, none of us. No, 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 no. I was there. Let's, okay. No, 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 no. She never said I'm gonna follow her. I was there. She, said, I'm a fire. she did say I'm gonna fire her. She said no. I'm gonna fire her. Listen, listen. She, she what she said was, I, 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 she was listening to the live, and she said, "Damn, I didn't ask her to do that. I didn't ask her to do that and go over there and say nothing." And she checked her when she came back. You said, and she said fire. Her. She said she was gonna fire her. That's what she oh, said. And I, I said in the comments. She could have. She could have. I just you know, I said that. in the comments, Diamond, you wrong for that. That should be handled on the back end. And she asked okay. me, what the fuck you mean or something? So that so you don't mean I don't know who you is. is. Can you write in the comment who you is? Because I'm not letting nobody up. I don't know who they is. I'm not familiar with the name. I'm sorry. I don't know who you are. So I was there when that happened. She said she was gonna fire the assistant. That's true. Cause she was in a panel she wasn't supposed to be, um, or whatever the case may be. And then Drop Queen was like, I think you should handle it on the back end. And then Diamond said, Well, what the fuck you mean? But this is given like when you break up with your boyfriend and you want to talk shit about them. But somebody in the comments wanted me to ask you, do you think that your daughters would be happy and applaud your behavior on this app? Somebody in the comments asked, not me. Uh, well, I'm a mama. What what? All my daughters say, Mama, you on TikTok cussing them people out? You need to get out for TikTok cussing people out. What? Well, my, my daughters are very proud of me. My daughter just told me, Mama, they asked me to write a letter. She's in 12th grade. Most kids don't even get along with their parents when they become teenagers. She's in 12th grade. She said, Mama, they asked us to write a letter about who our hero. I said, oh, yeah, who you wrote is your hero. I said, I know it's me. She said, you know well it was you. She said, I even screenshotted it because I want you to read it. So my kids, I give respect to my community. I give respect from um, um, the young women, like the ones I be arguing up here. I give respect for all of them because they know how I ride. They don't disrespect me. I'm not used to this disrespect. Maybe that's why I don't take it well. Maybe other people used to the disrespect, so it just slide off their back. Me, I'm not used to that disrespect. But no, so when Diamond told me, so so at that point I was still going to Diamond's live bar. But when she when she said something about the, what the fuck you mean or something, I didn't even hear it because I was making a cake. But AJ got up in the panel and so AJ started dragging it and she allowed AJ to drag it and humiliate me even more. So when somebody can humiliate you, curse okay, you, now we get so well. Right. Now still, we yeah. So that's when everything started falling, falling apart at that point, because I was still going there. I was still getting in the box. I just wasn't getting there and staying, you know, and staying often or getting there as often. But when she say, what the fuck you mean or something, you know what I'm saying? You know, I'm like, where, where that came from? You know what I'm saying? Your feelings was hurt uh, because you felt like she didn't speak, but she allowed somebody to speak for her. That's how you felt in that moment. Right, right. Well, not, it wasn't really that. Just her saying what the fuck you mean or whatever coming from me like that when I've never disrespected her. Never disrespected her through all yeah. disrespected her. Thank you, sweetie. So have you ever, like, you, so I, me, I heard you mention before that you had her number. So have you ever tried to reach out to her on the back end without everybody being like, hey, this is how I feel, so and so, you know what I mean, to get a clear understanding without the people listening? Well, I've never had a number. We've only oh, talked to you. Said you had her no, number. No, 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 you know, we talked on Instagram. Instagram. Oh, no, because one time you was, no, you know I don't miss shit. You said, I got no diamond number. I ain't trying to be her bestie. I ain't trying to be her friend. I don't call her because I don't want to. You remember that? That's what I said. See, you did miss it because you missed what Instigator just, just told you that she said what the fuck you mean that she was going to find a girl. So you miss it, Bart. Come on now, Bart. Well, I heard when she said that. I ain't talking about that, babe. I ain't talking about that. I know, but let me tell you. I'm talking about when we, this was way before. I know, let me tell you. Let me tell you. No, no, let me tell you. So Diamond had reached out to me on the back end on the DM. I didn't even believe it was Diamond. So I messaged her on Instagram. I said, was that you messaging me on the DM? She said, yeah, I wanted to, what's your number? And I said, um, and I said, uh, oh, you could call, just call me on Instagram. I didn't even want Diamond to have my number and I didn't want to have her number because I was trying to work on eggshells, eggshells to avoid all of this stuff that still happened. Mm -hmm. I'm trying hard. People, I mean, people used to be in the in the comments. Diamond, would you and they was in the cash app. Diamond, would you and Drop Queen just file out already so she could go? You know what I'm saying? So when when she so I was still coming there even after all that, but I just stayed off the panel. 
But so even after all that, never was disrespectful. I never had a problem with Dominic. I'm still gonna speak my mind to be the same person I've always been. So for her to get offended that I say, well, Dominic should be handled on the back end, she always say stuff should be handled on the back end. But then when I tell you, you handled on the back end, you offended enough to cuss me out. And then allow AJ to come up there. And I didn't hear her. Like I said, I didn't really hear her. Uh, drop king. Donna said, what the fuck you mean? You, like said, you know what I'm saying? So that that's kind of, that really put the nail up in the coffin. That she, when a person show you, they don't give a fuck about you. I mean, what do you want? And I, I'm, I'm not nobody's lap dog. You may think that, Barb, but I'm not nobody's lap dog. All right. So, so, okay, okay. Go ahead, Barb. But what I think is, what would you have to serve? What would you have to serve Donna be in that situation when all that shit was going on? Mm. Not, not so, okay. I'll, I'll, I'll say just like this: the same thing, uh, um, the same thing. Um, Peach wanted the bullshit to just be stopped. See, I was dog piled constantly every time I came up, all the time. Lied on. Alexis, you gotta nobody, nobody can tell me. Nobody can tell me. Can somebody up here tell me what I actually did to Diamond or to her or to her platform? I just, I, you, you want me to go first? Oh. Yes, you can go first. You was very mean and nasty for no reason. And I, I've not seen her be mean and nasty to you. I've seen her react to, you know, your, you you basically like was at her for, for what the panel did. And it's like, you hold her responsible for the panel. And I look in my eyes, I looked at it as if you was like, oh damn, Donnie, I spent this much money on you. You're not gonna be paying me, you're not gonna do that. And that's where I felt, you felt disrespected. You felt like, honestly, I felt like you felt like, hey, I brought my way in, bitch, you owe me this. You know what I'm saying? And then when she didn't give you what you wanted based off the amount of money that you spent, you felt some type of way. That's my opinion. Okay, so let me correct it. That's not what happened, Barb. Okay. First of all, me and Diamond never had a problem. Me and Diamond never had a fallen out, and I've never disrespected Diamond. And Diamond okay. didn't disrespect me until she said that, what the fuck you mean, drop queen, or whatever they were. Why did we, me and Diamond, why did all of this come about? That's the question. Y'all were for sure be from before that. We were not. Yeah, we knew about the seven thousand dollars before that. You were still going over there, but people, that but the tension between y'all was for of. sure still no, going back. Like, no, they was not beefing then. That we was not. that was a, a dime. I mean, Donna said, "Drop, are you okay with me showing this?" Right. And she was just showed that like, how much they, uh, people were seeing for drops. No, it wasn't on a beef mode. I remember that, and I was and I said because I remember I, the, drop. Don't please don't be offended. I said, "God nah, damn, drop a dumbass beef." I, see, but I was okay. having fun though. I thought that's how I support. I didn't want to buy. I didn't want like I'll go through other people's lives and drop the little corn bundle. I'll do yeah. that. I'll just slide and drop the corn. Bundle. But for that platform, it was fun. People be laughing. People be wondering who dropped the person. You know, it was it made the the thing is fun. It's fun when you're seeing people drop people. You know, it, it was just fun for me to be able to do that. It was fun for people to drop me. Then I started having people who liked me and would even pay a hundred dollars to bring me back. So I knew that I had people that really fucked with me like that. That was all fun. I was playing the game like I wanted to play it versus dropping people just like you said, oh, drop something in the cash app or send some coins or all that. I was just having fun playing the game. Oh, but no. let, let's go back to why me and Diamond, why all of this happened is because I was on Bella's Live and they brought up about the cash app. And I still on business. Uh, 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 exactly. Uh, uh, uh. So it wasn't because wait, she told wait, you that's what you're talking about. No, 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 no. I was there too. What happened was that, um, Bella was dogging Diamond out that day and you stayed while she was that's talking negative. Now, no, I remember true. this. Drop, if you hear me, I remember this and then you could say what you want and say if I'm lying. You, D Bella was dogging Diamond out, right? And they was like, how you support Diamond? And you was there and listened to Bella dog down now you was like well i support both of them i'm not getting to that for so what they could be friends and i'm stuck in the middle of that that's that whole shit came about that's not what happened Mark. i swear to God, i put that on my left foot it, let, let, it happened to me let me tell you what happened Mark. we were in a uh accountability court for the cash outs and for the haters brought up uh the, the accountability court was about the cash outs and about bella uh, showing cash outs or something like that to that effect. I don't even know what happened with Bell in the cash outs. But then haters say, well, that was just like when Diamond went to the DR and Nosy had her phone reading the cash outs. And I felt some type of way, so I stopped sending cash outs. So I felt that that was a good conversation to have because for me, if I send Manny a cash out, if I send you a cash out, if I send Diamond a cash out, for me, your husband shouldn't even see that cash out. I believe the cash out should be private. So I stood on my opinion that the cash out should be private. So when they started with that stuff about the haters started with the stuff about um the cash outs then until it went over 
and everybody went got down and because I got I guess Diamond went live and everybody got mad. Well, what I got to do with that? I have I'm, I'm a free thinker and I'm a grown woman. I can have my opinion. My opinion was the conversation should have been had so that everybody comes to understanding that how they platform feels about the cash out. When I used to go to uh, Lord Ninth Ward's live, he gonna call out your name for a cash out. So it's about each panel saying these are my rules for the cash out. So when people send cash out, they have an understanding of how the cash out will handle. That's what I believe. Other than that, I had not done Diamond or the Mafia anything. But they told me a whole. They they wanted to tap a hole in my ass because I stood on what I believed. But that I told. But remember, y'all. Let me ask you this. It, 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 if it's good for the goose, it's good for the gander, right? How, like, we all know that Bella, we all signed out, Bella was sitting in fake cash out. So why do you feel that way about just only Donna and not just Bella, who was, like, it's proven that she was sending out fake cash out? Why do I feel what way about Donna? Like, about the cash out, because we know that no one was never asked to read the cash out. They was asked to hold down a live while she used the restroom. They was just so happy that a cash out came through while she was in the restroom. Right. And those people were like, let me, I'm going to try to I wasn't mad at Diamond. That's my I wasn't mad at Diamond. So when you said, well, I feel that way about Diamond, I was not mad at Diamond for that. I just stopped on the panel. The fallout had already happened. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. The fall had already happened. Okay. Right. The fall hot. But I, but me and Diamond still didn't have a problem. We didn't have a problem. She mm -hmm. said she didn't have a problem with me. And I said I didn't have a problem with her. But it was all the other haters that was instigating and keeping the mess going. But I was still sending cash outs and all that stuff. I was still doing that. I wasn't dropping people like I had been. But I was still sending cash outs. I was still doing that. I didn't stop sending cash outs until she said, don't come over there no more. I don't go over there and I don't send no cash outs. So what's going to be the end of it? Like, you entering in because before this shit blows out of proportion, okay, you say, so the end goal is, the diamond said, they'll come back over there, you don't go over there. So, like, what's the end goal of all this? Like, like how do y'all come to, like, I don't discuss you, you don't discuss me. Like, how do y'all do that? Oh, well, that's my, that's my, I'm, I'm not, my experience is my experience. Be it uh, good, bad, or indifferent. If I want to talk about how I felt like I was treated over there, just like I'm talking about it now, Nobody can silence my experience. If she have an experience of me doing something bad to her, I have a she have a right to her feelings and her emotions, and I have a right to my feelings and my emotions. I told you the one thing I regret saying and doing, and that's the only thing. But anything else I've said and done is from what from my experience. If she's experienced me doing something bad to her, she have every right to say that I did that. So we don't think that sitting on a panel for five hours talking about a person that you don't really care about for months is not weird. <laughs> Really? People say, people do that to me all the time. People, have, I think, I think uh, somebody was holding a live about me. Maybe Trina holding a live about me right now. People hold lives about me all the time. What are we talking about? We don't message TikTok. Yeah, but that 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 didn't happen with Trina yesterday. So like, it's still fresh. No, somebody like, just messaged me. Hold on, let, I can go back. Hey, to um, hey, everybody on the town. No, the live was today. The live was today. When you're talking about what's today, but the issue between you and her happened yesterday, so it's still fresh. Um, Cecilia, oh, mind your big bag business. If you're not gonna say it to my face and hop up in the box, don't fucking talk about me. But what I'm saying is, um, like, I'm not gonna tell somebody. Uh, Nobody's not gonna tell me when enough is enough for me. Hey, Bart. Hey, everybody on the panel. Let me activate. Hey, Pete. I didn't even see you. Hey, y'all. How y'all doing? Hi. Hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. Listen, y'all know this is my birthday weekend. My birthday is Sunday. Hey, Bart. Hey, boo. I missed you. Uh, I'm off the rest of the day and the rest of the week. Okay, now be quiet. Be quiet. Peach, happy birthday, baby. I love you. Thank you, but love you too. Let me say something right quick. Drop Queen, I cannot believe you sitting on this motherfucking panel and you motherfucking lying. I just cannot motherfucking believe this shit. You is the driest lip lionest bitch I have okay, ever so fucking are seen. We, if she's not gonna be dropped, I'm gonna do not drop. Diamond, do not yeah, talk about you. She gonna be dropped, you talk I'm about Diamond. Oh, I, don't, I, don't I don't have time to, I don't have time to talk to no fucking fucking I, 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 I'm trying to talk to no fucking That's why you was mad I had on your profile. You was just offended that your motherfucking ass is really that ugly and somebody really wanna have your ugly ass on their motherfucking profile. You ugly, bad, Bill slew footed ass bitch. Tuck your motherfucking stomach and your motherfucking neck, bitch. So you see how this go, Bart? So you see how it go. So this is what I'm talking yeah, about. We all have okay, this conversation. Okay, I can't talk about y'all. Don't get sick. Go to the motherfucking doctor and get sick. Get sick at the motherfucking doctor. I'm sick of looking at your ugly ass. Why we got to deal with your ugly ass, bitch? I'm sick of you. I am sick of you. Well, go unalive if you that motherfucking sick, bitch. You can't look at your fucking face, holy. 
glass. You just mad. Don't be mad at me. You ugly bitch. Don't blame it on your mama and your bitch up ass daddy. Go find that ugly ass motherfucking man and get his motherfucking ass on your ugly ass motherfucking I'm tired of you. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm sick. I'm sick. I'm sick. I'm so sick. You just sick. You sick. Are you sick of your face? Are you sick of that? What are you doing? Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. Every time you wake up in the morning, bitch. All you, you keep doing is talking about diamonds every fucking and day. Am. Just let what you gonna talk do? about what you gonna do. What you gonna do? What you wanna do? What you gonna do? Bitch? Bitch? Real motherfucking what? life. Bring your whole thing. You don't have to act like this. Motherfuckers who so really be act this don't have to act pull like this. Pull, pull, pull up. Pull up. Pull up. Where you wanna pull up, bitch? Where you at? Drop the addy, ho. Come to VA, bitch. Come to VA. I go to every motherfucking state, bitch. Let me go, because I got a... Hey, Barbie, you don't open the door.